in the TV drama The Legend of Zhen Huan, Yong Zheng's consort Hua is so evil. She hurts many imperial women and always challenges the empress. She deeply loves the emperor Yong Zheng and thought Yong Zheng loved her. Unfortunately, this isn't true. At the end, the consort Hua lost everything. And dies in the cold palace. Now, in this video, let's see the stories of the consort Hua in real history. In real history, the Emperor Yongzheng didn't have consort Hua. The consort Hua in the TV drama was Yongzheng's noble consort Nian Shi. Nian Shi originally was from Han Chinese bordered white banner. In 1711, the Emperor Kangxi chose her as the Prince Yong's Che Fujin, which was the first rank concubine of the prince. Sooner, the Prince Yong totally fell in love with her and spent most time with her. When the Prince Yong became the Emperor Yongzheng, he directly gave Nian Shi the noble consort title. Because Yongzheng had empress, so the noble consort Nian was the extra highest rank consort. In 1725, the noble consort Nian was hopelessly sick. Yongzheng promoted her to the imperial noble consort. Several days later, the imperial noble consort Nian passed away. Nian Shi was a pretty and well-educated woman. Different with the TV drama, Nian Shi had great personalities. She really respected the empress. So, she and the empress had a great relationship. Nian Shi totally gave birth three boys and one girl. Unfortunately, none of them grew up. In 1715, four years after her marriage, Nian Shi gave birth her first kid, which was a little princess. This little princess died at two years old without name. In 1720, Nian Shi gave birth her second kid, a boy. Nian Shi and the Prince Yong were really happy for the newborn baby. Unfortunately, only several months, this little boy died. At that time, Nian Shi was pregnant with her third kid. Nian Shi's third kid, kid didn't grow up, but he passed away after Nian Shi's death. In 1722, Nian Shi last time pregnant. Unfortunately, in the same year, the Emperor Kangxi passed away. Nian Shi must follow all funeral process. Countless ball made Nian Shi exhausted. So, she suffered difficult labor which made her son died immediately after birth. After this, Nian Shi totally corpsed. Even worse, Nian Shi's older brother, Nian Geng Yao, lost Yong Zheng's trust. In 1725, Nian Geng Yao lost all government positions. At that time, Nian Shi was already hopelessly sick. Yong Zheng worried her feelings, so he didn't kill Nian Geng Yao. But after Nian Shi passed away, Nian Geng Yao was killed. The Nian family totally lost their powers and wealth. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon.